The devil inside me has gotten much worse. If I didn't write music, I wouldn't be able to express my emotions at all. I'm nervous, bro. I can't stop shaking. There's uh, quite a lot of people out there. Hull is one of the most depressed places in the country. Music is amazing therapy for mental health. It helped me with my depression. I want other young people to have access to that. With the help of NCS, I'm going to be setting up a permanent music studio in the famous Adelphi Club in Hull. I'm hoping the first person to use this studio is the talented young rapper, Wormack. Wormack is struggling with anxiety and his confidence needs a huge boost. I want to be a rapper but he's just like hard on the stage. Like, I can't find the, like, the strength just to go on the stage and just like be so free and just like, just like you are. You've got to kind of act like you're already a famous rap star when you're up there sort of thing because that's what people want to see. We're going to write and lay down a new track together and perform it on the Adelphi stage in front of an audience. He's never performed before, but I'm hoping by the end of it, all his fears will be gone. Instead of staying in your one spot, you've got to like expand yourself. Yeah. Like that whole stage is yours. It's overwhelming. The devil inside me has gotten much worse. It's the witchcraft of monsters, I think I've been cursed. These corrupted estates, they've been battling pain. I'm trying to fix them, but I think it's too late. The, the track's talking about how uh, young people like me are growing up on these council estates, and uh, people are oblivious to what, what actually goes on. I've seen that myself as well, people struggling. And I know at points in my past I've felt like I ain't had a future either. Yeah, I have. I think music, that's definitely giving me hope. Yeah, yeah, definitely, because if I didn't write music, I wouldn't be able to express my emotions at all. I think it's really going to give the studio an awesome atmosphere as well. I managed to get some help from the local community and the studio is finally ready. This is the studio. Oh man, this is sick. So do you think you can uh, yeah. lay down some sick stuff in here? Yeah, yeah, definitely. It's a nice space. You'll hear four clicks and then it's recording. Let's start in the dark of these counts of the states. Anxiety and pain, hope can fade away. I feel some... Yeah, sorry, we'll keep rolling in your own time. I feel some way about myself on stage. Have you felt the same? This real to me. This is... Nah, nah, start again. I feel some way about myself on stage. Have you felt the same? This is... Nah, nah, nah. I'll take a break, yeah, one second. Are you going to keep taking a break? Yeah, we'll listen yeah. through what you've got and then you can pick up on where you've made a few mistakes. Oh, right. No worries. I'm nervous, bro. I can't stop shaking. You're nervous? Yeah, yeah. Do you think messing up up there in the studio kind of made it a bit worse? Yeah, a little bit. Remember that your friends and family are out there in the crowd and they're not here to laugh at you, they're here to support you. It's just like these like butterflies in my stomach. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, there's uh, quite a lot of people out there. One of the things that I've always like kept in mind as well that my dad told me is that people don't want to see the boy next door. They want to see a legend. Growing up on these hands, fam. I remember my bro would text, man. But now he's off living in the next land. I ride pain to the best man. Said I got to keep it real. I actually really enjoyed Wormack's performance because he was so nervous for it. Instead of letting his anxieties take over him, he just freestyled it. In just one day, I've seen Wormack overcome his anxieties and is now on the way to becoming a class performer.
We've built a permanent recording studio that allows other young people in Hope to tackle their mental health and live their dreams of recording music. I'd like to thank everyone for coming. Sweet, bro. I want to be a rapper because I want to influence people. I want my voice to be heard. And I feel like if I can do this, then I can do anything. <laughs>